What's up, you guys? Hey, you guys. Welcome back to the Know For Sure podcast. This episode is going to be a two-parter. So enjoy the first part, okay? Enjoy the first part. The second part. It's going to be on Patreon only, you guys. Only. It's only for our chain gang. You guys know we give you guys exclusive content, bonus content. You can only watch part on two on Patreon. And it's so good. It's so juicy. It's so deep. We love Krishan Rock. So catch out part two on Patreon. But for now, enjoy part one. Is it me? But I can't escape it. Because they are watching my mouth. Why I can drop it on my dick? Oh, I need it. Ooh. <laughs> We're back, KFS family. You already know what's going on. Relax. Okay, it's I like so excited. It's like too many clackies. I got the drum. <laughs> too many clackies. I got the drum. It's like relax. I can't. <laughs> this is gonna be a great ass episode. We got a bomb guest, but before we get to that, get to that, get to that. You've been changing your accent lately. I was like, I don't know what's going Before on. Before we you. get to that, mm-hmm. we're back. <laughs> Start that shit again. <laughs> Bitch, I need you to jump in. Please. Oh, Jesus. I cannot hold it that long, and you know it. <laughs> I'm like, we're back. <laughs> If I got to do all that, you're not doing your job. <laughs> oh, Lord. It's just too much. Y'all, sometimes. I don't care. <laughs> We're committed to it. Welcome back to the Know For Sure podcast. Okay, so are we going to do it? Yes, I am B. Small. <laughs> and I'm Megan Ashley. <laughs> Where we talk about healing, growing, evolving, and having the tough conversations. If you have not listened to our podcast, thank you for being here. We're best friends of 20 years, baby. My girl. <laughs> She drives. I always gotta dab myself up. She drives. I gotta me. hug myself, kiss myself, dab myself up, love myself. Jesus, can I get a little <laughs> love and affection? <laughs> I gotta hug myself, heal myself, talk to myself, encourage myself. No, you do all those no, things see, too. When I tell you that, <laughs> me, 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 ah, ah, me and Jesus, me and Jesus. Sometimes I need a friend. <laughs> Good Lord, got too many. Is anyone out there? Where is the help for the helper? What movie is this? Hello out there. Is anyone alive out there? Titanic? Yeah. I did great. But no one's, she didn't say, is anyone alive out there? The guy did. While she was blowing the whistle. Oh. Don't, you knew the movie, so that means I did my job. <laughs> Don't say Titanic. That didn't happen. But why were you so into it? I had to give my all, you know? <laughs> like I do when we do, we're back. All right, come on. We're back. Megan. My <laughs> fucking funny. lip is shaking. <laughs> Your eyelashes are like, relax. We got a good guest on today, so I'm trying to get to the nitty gritty. I know. But. More, more importantly, mm-hmm. it's official. What's official? The merch is out now. We're back. Megan. I was talking about the merch, and you're talking about we're back. <laughs> you, I've done it three times. So you're like, I'm not moving on until you do I'm it. not budget on it. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, 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 before we go on with this episode, I know you see it. They see it, man. They see it. They see it. They love it. They see this merch on our backs and our ass. The merch is out now, y'all. The merch is out now. Go to our website, theknowforsure.com, and copy. I got on a graphic tee with our faces, and on the back is the QR code. Meg got on the long sleeve. The long sleeve to evolve, grow, and heal. Long sleeve with the little... Think about what, what you're, you're thinking, thinking about, about on the wrist. Nice See, it's in the detail. You know, we, we got quality for y'all. It's thick. It's quality. It ain't gonna. It ain't gonna be all so cheapy, comfortable. Cheapy. It's comfortable. And the sweats, the know for sure, the number one podcast in the world, down the leg. The merch is out now. Y'all have been asking. Go to the website, theknowforsure.com, and cop your merch. We love you guys. Back. 
to the show. Is your non-negotiable? I'm not doing it. <laughs> <laughs> Where's the compromise? <laughs> it's Fine. like if I merge just... here. <laughs> Let's okay, get... okay, you're back. We're back. Go on. We're back. back. Woo! Thank you, Jesus. You're very welcome. Your eyebrows look great. Thanks. Waxed. Not threaded. Not shaved. <laughs> Not plucked. She did well, actually con- pluck them. That shit hurt. Congratulations. I like them. They're okay. getting thick. They are. Well, they're always thick. Er. But they look great. Like my ass. All right. <laughs> this is going to be a doozy, guys. This is going to be a doozy. After we announce this guest, y'all going to be like, Jesus. For sure. Going to be lit. Um, but we do have on the merch, y'all. We have on the merch. It is out now, the knowforsure.com. Go get it. Let me show y'all. It's crazy. What I got on. If you're not watching, sorry for you. You need to watch. Can I even get you in the camera? Okay, I'll be the announcer. We have Braylon. No, no. Jesus. <laughs> we have the beautiful B. Simone in the Know For Sure graphic tee. It's given. <laughs> <laughs> It's given Vogue Urban Outfitters. It's given. It's given Rent is Due on the first. QR code on the back. You guys, this merch, we really put every detail. Like, we were so involved in every little piece of this. Like, it is all of us. We hope you guys love it. I hope you guys got the merch. I hope you guys really, really like it. Because we spent so much time trying to do... We you were know, so particular. Yeah, we were really picky. Yeah, the and we, details. Think about what you're thinking about. Heal, grow, evolve. Our picture, our logo on the back is a QR code that you can scan it. There's a letter from us, from B&I on the back. On the back. Yeah. Like, we really, and there's, like, the little chain gang sign. Yeah. Um, we, but we really, like, wanted you guys to feel what you feel when you watch the podcast. Yeah. Like, to be encouraged, to have fun, yeah. to, you know. And to feel like. Obviously, our merch isn't cheap. We're not selling $10, $15 yeah. t-shirts, you know. But when you put it on, you're going to feel like you're in luxury merch. Yeah, it's, like quality, it's quality, for sure. We work so hard on this, and we just love it. Yeah. I love it. I hope you guys love it. And we want to know if you love it, so please yeah. drop the comments. Um, let us know, like, how you feel about it. Yeah. Okay, now you got to model your shirt. Oh, okay. I'll model my shirt. Okay. Aaron's like, Aaron's Jesus. Like, Jesus Christ. Tell can me what you have want. a system. <laughs> Which way am I going? Right here? Right here. Okay. I'm just showing the Megan back. got on the heel evolve. Excuse me. I'm belching. Grow. Mm-hmm. Long sleeve Long shirt. Sleeve. The front has the logo. And on the wrist. It says, think about what you're thinking about. Shout out to my mama who yep. always told me that. Think so. about what you're thinking about. Jesus. The back again? Yep. The, the back. What does it say? Evolve, heel, grow. Yep. And the, like, uh, the sweats. Sweat. Now, you guys. These sweats mean so much to me because when we were trying samples um, of the sweats. Say it again. These sweats mean a lot to me because when we were trying samples, the first sample that we had had these inside pockets. zip it pocket pockets. And I was yeah. like, oh, I love this yeah. because sometimes, you know, when you have sweats on, like you'll sit down and stuff will fall out your, po- you know, out of your pocket. Extra compartment. That zips up. So if you have like something important in your wallet, your, you know, your keys, keys whatever, chains. you can zip it up. Change. But when we... With the first sample that we had, we ended up going with another sample, and I was like, it has to have the zipper. So, yeah. and we got the zipper. And we got the zipper. So it's, it's only one zipper, though. It's on the left side. Yeah. Um, but there's a zipper inside. I love that. It's so comfortable. It's so like dope. It's thick. It's, it's thick quality. quality. When you put yeah. this shit on, you're going to be like, okay. Yeah. I see why I paid my money for this merch. Yeah. It's going to be something that you want to keep forever. Yeah. It's going to be like you know the throw on yeah. saturday and vintage chill. when you wash it it's still gonna look good. yeah these shirts are gonna look fire so dope so yeah oh we so do recommend it. though these shirts are like an oversized type of fit so i would recommend like if you like that oversized look to go up a size like yeah, i'm yeah, a yeah. small but i liked it as a medium, a medium on me so i wonder what size this is i think that's a medium medium mm-hmm. i like the medium too so i have on a medium it's baggy though yeah it's like baggy so just a little yeah yeah but yeah. yeah the sweat say number one podcast in the world thank you guys so much Manifest. for manifesting that with us <laughs> y'all are manifesting it with us we made it to number 10 in the world yeah out of five hundred thousand podcasts, podcasts that are out there five hundred thousand plus i googled how many podcasts <clears throat> are on apple and it's five hundred thousand plus and we made it to number 10 in the world and y'all are helping us manifest number one yeah 
it's, it's gonna, gonna happen. happen yeah it's gonna happen so yeah so um, yeah what else do we need to go over nothing it's just been a it's been a crazy week we've been like you know the merch is dropping the live show is around the corner meetings meetings and work stuff and it's just been traveling yeah We're i going am to london next week i know and i am looking forward to I don't know. I'm looking forward to that just because we're going out of the country yeah, for the first time. This is our time first time going out of the country together. together. Yeah. So I'm excited for that. But then it's like, I need a, I don't know. Maybe I'm just like, I just need to breathe different air for a second. Yeah. You know yeah. what I mean? Like, I yeah. need to like. Yes. Get out of the country. Yeah. Like, I just need <laughs> really, to Really, we just, wish we were going to an island. But, seriously. Um, that'll happen next year. Yeah. But we already know we're doing that in January. I'm excited. Um, it's just been, it's, I've gotten the f- a real glimpse of entrepreneurship yeah. this week. This was like yeah. a very yeah. rough week. And so getting that first glimpse of like, you know, just decisions running that a running a business yeah. decisions that you have yeah. to make. And it was just been, you know, yeah. Separating business and pleasure. Yeah. It's just, it's hard. It's, yeah. it's not an easy thing to do. And yeah. this week was my first week, like feeling it more than yeah. we've ever had to feel it. Yeah. So, um, I think that's a good thing, though. Yeah, and it that's is. never gonna stop. We're gonna have yeah. to make decisions like that throughout our whole career, and that's just what comes with entrepreneurship. Entrepreneurship. Any entrepreneurs out there, just know the shit's not easy. <laughs> but when you focus on that end goal and your purpose and what you want to do, yeah, baby, there's no other option. Oh, I'm. Oh my gosh, the what? food. Oh yeah, it's one minute, oh, two minutes away. Jesus, that I'm ass. so sorry. <laughs> oh, she said, oh my god. <laughs> The food. <laughs> I was just making sure it was on its way. No, it's but coming. yeah, um, but yeah, yeah this was here. the first week like feeling it. I think fully, like yeah. feeling the the the, the pressure stress, and the yeah. stress. I was just like and making. Decisions. And then it was like, and then it's and because we're moving around so much. <laughs> oh my god, we can stop here. Hi, hi. <laughs> no, we were doing the intro. <laughs> It's a white lady out there. <laughs> like, Jesus. Well, give us a minute. No, Just, let's keep going. Well, we, hi. <laughs> we have our guest. Our guest is here. Look at her. Yeah, sit down. Give me a hug. I know. I'm like, give me a hug. Yes. Yeah. We're going to get you together. I just went like, oh my God. I gotta go. You look beautiful. Let me be like, where? Oh, he's so cute. Hey. <laughs> yes, <laughs> tooth. Yeah, yeah. She's like, hey. No, go get ready. Go She's get a, ready. Yeah, go You're get fine. ready. You're, You're fine. fine. You got time. Take your time. Yes, go upstairs. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> yeah, uh, I don't. I don't have a brush. I have a comb. I don't have she a not brush. In this episode. She needs to be. She can <laughs> pop in. Pop in me. <laughs> you supposed to be in this. Jesus. This, this God Jesus moment. <laughs> well, hey, you y'all. You want some drink? You want some water? Yeah, you want water? Sure. You want some water? You want, what do you want? Yeah. You want some? Okay, let me get you a water. Cute. <laughs> you like, I really don't. Just saying, yeah. Right. Like, I don't want no water. <laughs> Oh yeah, well, come or, and let, let me let me do it. <laughs> Are you getting all this, Aaron? Get all this good stuff, y'all. Guess who just walked in the motherfucking building? Who already started? That's crazy. We gonna do a proper intro. You want to be in this? She's like, I don't want ginger ale. <laughs> <laughs> Pull the mic to her, V, just so that they can hear her talking. Oh, y'all can No, now we can. Oh, hey. Bitch, now whole Look at Vina, y'all. Yeah, first yeah, of all, yeah, yeah, yeah. We doing our intro. Krishan Rock just walk in the door talking about there's a white lady out there. She is doing something. She is. She asked me. She said, "You in this?" I said, "Yeah." She said, "I for how long?" I said, "I don't know you." <laughs> like you all she, up in the business. I was like, "You own this house?" She was like, "No, I'm the neighbor." Well, give me a second. It look good now. And Pretty V is combing her hair. I don't know. I just won't be asking the nigga next to me. How long you in the house next right, to me? Like right. it's none of your business. 
Her old white ass. God forgive me. She's talking She's, about not God forgive me. You want to put your purse down? She said, "I want to hold it." I just like, don't know where they go. You can sit it down. And I left my phone with them. Can you um tell? Who do you need? Can you go get them? Jesus, you rented the house out mm-hmm. for this shit. That's crazy. You got money. <laughs> <laughs> I would have been like, "Hey, Rock, can I come to your house?" No, for sure. Can we set up at your place? <laughs> Why didn't we? What's <laughs> better? You are so beautiful. You're so I pretty. Bitch, I said that when you came to college. So me. pretty. This is beautiful. So pretty. Oh, Skin, good. everything. Give me another hug. Uh, so you are so cute. Those so cheeks, cute. baby. You know, them, I know. Them uh, cheeks. You are like, oh my God. You look <laughs> <laughs> Somebody needs to go. Wait, the food is here. V, I hey, think. <laughs> I think they dropped it at the door. V, can you get the food? Can you get, can you get my peoples? Yeah. Oh, yeah. oh my <laughs> gosh. Here we go. Here we fucking go. Let's let's get it. Right, right. I Good. want it, bro. What? Okay. What you need? What? I need my press on. No. <laughs> that table is why we should okay. be careful. Come on. Oh, Jesus. Whose dog is this? Is this your dog? Right. Hi. Hi. Is he gonna pee? Well, he can't pee in here. Okay, he's trained. He All right, come here. I right, whoop his ass. Mm-mm. Come here. Come um, on. is her mic okay? Oh, he's heavy. Hi. Hi. <laughs> Blue rock. Blue rock. Hi, baby. Get uh uh-uh. uh. Hi, rock. Come on, come on, come on, y'all. You doing too much. <laughs> Sit. Thank you. Now. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, Sag, no, let me stop balls, like I can, what, rock, boom, I can put boy. it together later. Come Unless on. y'all want to just go ahead and start eating, it's up to you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, yeah, yeah, go ahead. Ahead. yeah, yeah. Is this live or something? No. Oh. <laughs> no, because that's that was that just a minute ago. You are you ready? Yeah, I'm ready. Okay. <laughs> First of all, y'all, <laughs> this girl, I love her. Number one. Number two. This morning, you don't have to hold your purse. Why well, look cute? <laughs> Ain't nobody finna steal your bag. Why well, look cute? <laughs> it was nothing but my nigga uh, car key in here. Ain't nothing else to it. Y'all, we got Krishan <laughs> Rock in this bitch. Yes. Okay. Um, I'm so excited. Yeah, so, all right, right just sit it there. Yeah. We so I excited. She was on. supposed to, we, at first we had a 9 o'clock call time. You don't want to know what time it is? This bitch walking here at 1 p.m. I said, we don't give a fuck. You know why? Because we wanted her on the No For Sure podcast. Yes. I am baby. so sorry. That's no. <laughs> oh, <geez. Yeah>. Damn. <laughs> because I thought I was. She said, I am so sorry. I told you. Tell I, her the truth. No, I <laughs> told you not to rush. No, she yeah. She said 1230. I did. She I did. did. She did. New location. She did. <laughs> yeah. I know. Tell her. I y'all switching shit up. Tell her. I woke up like fucked up, feeling sick. Oh, no. Oh, yeah, you went out. What did y'all do last night? No, I still do feel sick. I think it's, I don't know. Drink some ginger ale. Right. But. What's wrong? What do you feel? Nauseous. Mm. Oh, okay. Okay. You're so cute. You're so a little cute. baby. How old are you? Uh, hopefully it's like something else and not something else. Krishan. Well, I'm being dead ass. Don't play like that. I'm not playing. I, I really, it took me forever to do my face. In the car. Do you normally get nauseous? No. Unless car sick, but I'm not in no car. I still, Oh my God! So are you pregnant? <laughs> Girl, I don't know. <laughs> give me a minute to figure it out. Yeah, give me a minute to figure it all out. All right, all right. We ain't gonna talk about that. All right, all right. Let's do an icebreaker. I can't okay. wait though. Icebreaker. I have a baby. I'm keeping it this time. Jesus. What? I well, killed like three of them. Okay, Krishan, wait. What? I'm ready, ready now. Oh, Jesus. You know, you always have that bad feeling. Like, mm, it's not right. It's not the right time. Mm-hmm. You think it's the right time now? I wouldn't mind if but it was right now. But do you right think now. it's the right time? Yeah. You think it's the right time? No, I need a ring, but you're right. All right. Okay, you you you, you speaking that spiritual so let's slow shit. Down. Okay. <laughs> let's slow you're in the down right bit. now. But, I'm just asking. But if it happened, I ain't stopping to happen. But, 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 but if it is it the right time? No, yeah. do I'm you not think? Happy. Do you think it would make? Mm, do you I'm think it would make things better or worse? Keep the mic closed. The way God be fucking with me, it's going to be better. But like, mm. Better for who? You? Mm. Me. Or mm. your relationship? Everything. Everything. It's tied to me. Just in life. It's to me, yeah. You think it would kind of calm things down? No. I'm not a calm person. But I'm saying, if, uh, if you brought a baby into the world, how do you think your lifestyle your life is going to change? Your life would change positively.
All right, you guys, really, really quick before we move on, we are about to put our KFS family onto something. Now, there is something really, really special about looking good in the gym and being comfortable. But let's be honest, it's hard to find leggings that look as good as they feel. But now Nike has created just the pair, the Nike Go Leggings. Listen, whether I actually go to the gym or not, mm-hmm. I want to look and feel so good in my leggings. Well, girl, Nike got us. The new Nike Go Leggings are crafted with smooth Infinilock fabric for that locks in feeling and and it's the compressive feel you want without the squeeze. With an extra wide waistband and hidden draw cord, Nike Go leggings are designed for everybody's type, y'all. They even have six pockets, man. Six pockets? Six pockets. Girl. You know you got three kids, you need all them pockets, enough for your phone, your keys, your credit cards, them kids' toys. Listen, as a mom, a hundred percent. I need all the pockets. They're all my kids are always handing me stuff, so I need <laughs> pockets. Yes, you guys. And also, these firm support leggings are made to get at your toughest workouts without slowing you down. They go so hard at a workout class, and they stay put while you're running. But they're also comfy, flattering, and a fit you can wear all day. We want our KFS fam to go get your go-to leggings right now at Nike.com. Yes, love you guys. Back to the show. And we don't have to I talk about this. I think if I have a kid, that's when I probably finally meet his kids. Or like, sometimes people are scared to know if like mm. things are temporary or mm-hmm. is it long term. term. So yeah. like, we we say, oh, we want this long term, but like yesterday, I was finna leave. Why? Mm. <sighs> Girl, and, 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 and mind and you, before, before, play, before we before we start, before we start, <laughs> this I'm talking to them now. This podcast is for. Our our viewers and our followers to be open and vulnerable. Yeah, I'm actually going yeah. for right now. I I'm saying know. anything you don't want to answer, you don't oh, have yeah, to. Yeah, have to. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This yeah. is. For, I like you. I'm answering everything. Yeah. <laughs> like I'm chilling, right? I just want to want that to be known. Oh, okay, right. but um, but you're saying that if it were, you're saying that it would open up for things to be more cohesive. Yeah, in I your think, relationship, I think it would be like more serious. Yeah, I mean it's serious now because like usually he would tell me go. It's something bad. This time I'm trying to leave. He trying to stop me from leaving. So mm-hmm. I'm like something different. In Is that relationship. usual? It, does he usually try to do that or no? No, like mm. he was like you got my passcode to my phone. He gave it to me. Like I'm like what? I don't. Mm. I I see like how serious he want to be now. Like at first it was. What more do you like, think changed that though? Like my belief system. So mm. it's whatever you mm. know. It's it's who you are. Your character. Like you know. There's personalities, but. Who are you in every room? Are mm-hmm. you timid? Are you shy? Or are you crush on? Are mm-hmm. you yourself? Yeah, I'm me yeah. in every room I come mm-hmm. in. I love that. So I like, love that. I feel like in a relationship, I'm crush on too. So, and then there's God, and my belief system mm-hmm. is crazy. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Like even though that's not how I started, you know. You have. I'm a- not one of those motherfuckers. Be like, yeah. So I, I'm waiting for the. No, I know mm-hmm. what I'm waiting for. I know what's going to happen next. It's mm-hmm. kind of like, you know. Good for you. How are you? Oh, I'm 22. 22. Man, you're so young. So How young. long have you guys been in a relationship, you and Blue? Um, you a baby. It's been, I met this nigga, what, 2020? We start really fuck with each other probably like, so like a, year. a week ago, real serious. <laughs> <laughs> Swear to God. <laughs> Swear to God. <laughs> it did. So I'm, so I'm, going, like, I, I'm going through a real good breakthrough right now it's in no, my relationship. No, that's my good, money. but you're, that's funny. But, Krishan, but I'm you're saying you, you just started. Like y'all been together two years, bitch. <sighs> I've been dealing with y'all. Okay, okay, okay. But what's the, I, I want to get back to the breakthrough because I want to come to that. It's crazy. I'm going I want to come it. to that. But real quick, I want to ask this last question. I'm happy question to be on. on your show too right now. Thank you. Oh. Like it's, it's God too. Like the timing steps. Mm. Everything's know. divine. Everything's it divine. It is. Bitch, I literally looked at the, I was on my phone whenever I was feeling. Yeah, so let's tell them how you yeah, got how here. You got how here, you yeah. got here. And it's on my little explorer and then her face popped up with tears. So I'm like, I clicked it because I'm always crying. Like, let me see this bitch it was the one. It was the clip that, you know, God is... Uh, there's nothing you can do to make God stop loving you. Yeah. Yeah, so, yeah, and I was like, <laughs> <laughs> I'm crying with it. Like, me, when I cry with stuff, you feel I it. cry with movies. I, cr- yeah. I, I just let yeah. it out. Yeah. I don't, Good. I don't like to be that person, like, I know that hurt when you watched it. Why didn't mm-hmm. you cry? Oh. So I'm one of them people, that. like, I'm going to cry. Yeah. So when I saw her, she, I'm like, I'm going to cry. <laughs> <laughs> so then I DM'd her, like, 
I want to come on your podcast. Oh my like, gosh. wow. I can see God moving through you. Wow. Through my phone. It was cool. Wow. wow. You're, you're anointed. I love you. Wait, that you made me cry. That made me cry. After our conversation, that. y'all, yeah. we FaceTime. Before I, I had it, back. like, you know, uh, missing too bad, a baby gap like yours. No. <laughs> 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 we talked. Cat. We talked for an hour, uh, almost an hour on FaceTime. Yeah. We were just talking, and I'm like, "This girl is like." Like yeah. I knew her for years. So. Yeah. yeah, you're anointed too, though. God got His hand B, on you. B, B the- was texting me like, "I wish you could hear I her. Wish you she's could hear so how she's talking. Amazing. She's so yeah. amazing. She's so sweet. She's so smart. She's so anointed. She everything that the media portrays you not to be." You get what, what I'm you saying? What you going to see in this docuseries? Like, We're going to talk about that. Yeah, we're going to talk okay. about that. You're going to see a it, different It's going to show of more of like who I am, like how I'm on. What, yeah. what I'm on phone. You a baby and you so smart. But I, I want to get back to, I have one more question. What's the other question? About you being a mama. Okay. Okay. Do you think that that, you said it might bring y'all closer, but do you think a child will change Blue's character? I mean, he's already changing for real. So okay, okay. I feel like. Okay. It's not really changes, it's like transition. Okay, it's okay. Elevation, okay. growth. Okay, okay. Um, it depends who the person is. Yeah. So he if been doing, dealing with it. some dumb motherfuckers his whole life that I got him way way like he he's cool, but like far as like the woman, the sensitive part, the mm-hmm. oh, I wanna like settle down and take this actually and give it a chance because I'm not familiar with this. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. It's more like a process. Yeah. For real. Okay. And they were both ghetto. Like, I can't explain it. It's like growing up with a brother I know. Mm. For real. <laughs> like, I don't get my brother, but I love him. Mm-hmm. So. That's deep. For real. So there's an attachment there that may be un- unexplainable. Yeah, because like everything connection. in my life been temporary. He, he has, has mm. it been. So it been like. I don't know. I can't explain. And then my dream. I don't know. I'm like driven on God right now. So it's like the people I deal with and what I allow to put up with is for a reason. Mm-hmm. And you feel then, like there's a bigger purpose in all of for it. For sure. For sure. Longevity. Mm. All right, you guys, really, really quick before we go on with the show, we about to put y'all on to something like we always do here at KFS. All right, Bestie, I got a question for you. Megan, what is your favorite food? I love Thai food. Okay, so would you eat Thai food from a gas station? I would not. I don't think a (laughs) gas station is the place to trust Thai food. That sounds like food poisoning is waiting to happen. Okay, exactly. So finding the right Thai food makes all the difference, right? The same goes for finding the right doctor. That's why I love ZogDoc, and you should too. ZogDoc is a free app that shows your doctors who are patient reviewed they take your insurance and are available whenever you need them on zogdog you can find every specialist under the sun whether you're trying to straighten out those teeth fix an achy back get a mole checked out or anything else zogdog has you covered listen you guys because i have kids i love to go on zogdog and look at the reviews from other moms to make sure they got what they need and they also love those doctors yes with zogdog you can find and review local doctors guys read verified patient reviews from the real people who made real appointments now when you walk into that doctor's office, you're all set to see someone in your network who gets you. Every month, millions of people use ZocDoc, and I'm one of them. It's my go-to whenever I need to find and book a quality doctor. Girl, me too. Go to ZocDoc.com slash KFS and download the ZocDoc app. Then start your search for the top-rated doctors today. Many are available within 24 hours. That's Z-O-C-D-O-C dot com slash KFS. ZocDoc.com slash KFS. Yes, you guys, check them out. Back to the show. Like, you can find that in your relationships or a word of God. I don't know. Like, you listen to Sarah Jenks? Mm-hmm. Yeah, we yeah. love Sarah We were Jenks. on her podcast, mm-hmm. her show. Love her. So, her. all right, did you listen to that one of Hope? It was a couple days ago? I have I, I haven't. I probably need to go there. I wish I would have done March before this podcast. <laughs> so good. Mm-hmm. It was good? What was it about? What did you take from it? Right now, my life. Uh, it was... The character part, like, she was like, um, so she was talking about all her kids and how, you know, she's helping her six-year-old develop her personalities, Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. but, like, her 25-year-old, she's explaining about them, like, um, it's not, like, it's, like, who you are when you're in the room. Like, I don't know. It was was so deep. Like, I can't even... Something that you could relate to, though. Yeah. Yeah, because... 
I'm that person in every room. Like, what's mm-hmm. your character? Like, she said, you can get whatever you want. You can be whoever you are, but it's, it's, it's who are you? Who are you? Internally. Yeah, Internally. Your like. Character. Your character. Are you, like, wh- where, wh- where is your belief system at? Mm-hmm. Like, And you spoke, you spoke, you've <coughs> said that a few times. Because me, I feel like system. I'm fighting demons for real. Like, mm. with people, like, say if it's something that I'm trying to work out, but I have to chase the devil away from it. Like, mm, I, feel I can't like, explain it. Like, no, I understand that. I but Sarah like, Jake's explaining that, like, yeah, crazy. Especially in the industry we're in, we're always gonna have to battle between spirituality and yeah, like I'm in spiritual warfare. And I'm, yeah, yeah. So, what do like, you feel like is your? Where is the balance between like knowing like your relationship with Blue? You're like, I know it's a bigger purpose in it, right? As far as why you guys are together or the longevity of it, it might be a bigger purpose. So where's the balance between knowing that and not and having a healthier relationship in the meantime? Even with yourself. Because like it's can... it, from what we see. And obviously what we see is all, is not the entire truth. We just mm-hmm. see what the media puts out there, what you guys decide to put out there. But what is the balance yeah, cause we, for y'all? We're not scared to show y'all how ugly we are. Mm-hmm. So it's like if we're transparent, we are ugly. That just says a lot about who we are, for real. But because I feel like there's people that we probably love, but they mm-hmm. never showed us their their real the true colors. Yeah, yeah, they never the showed us colors. they're yeah. ugly, and it who could they probably be are. uglier than what the fuck I'm really going through. Mm-hmm. So honestly, I'm not really sure on what that. What was that question? What is the balance between God. the 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 long term and the in between <laughs> time? Like, how can you guys maintain? Or how important is it for you to have a healthier relationship? Like, how are y'all getting to being more healthy? Because I feel like he's starting to realize what he really wants. So you're know. being patient. Yeah. Do you feel like most of the toxicity is him? For sure. Okay. Because it's like, okay, I met you with a family and, you, mm-hmm. and groupies, and you'll probably spend three days with this bitch and three days with that bitch and two days, one day mm-hmm. with your baby mom. Like, you get what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. So it's like... He had, like, a system before I met him. Like, it takes time to break down the system to mm-hmm. rebuild one. So. Do you set boundaries? Do you oh, have yeah, boundaries? Oh, yeah, for sure now. Like, right now, I'm starting to pop my shit. Like, all okay. right. Like, what, what's going on? What you mean? Because mm-hmm. like, guy moving. Like, mm-hmm. are you going to move? Look at you. Or are you about to get, like, you know what I'm yeah, saying? Yeah, or I'm going to move behind. past you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. It's Good like for you. It's like, because I really, I really know what I want. So, like, I'm patient, too. Mm-hmm. But it's like, you're going to feel it in your gut when it's time, it's to, time like, to, move. like, switch it up. What you mean? Like, what we doing? Mm-hmm. It was good. So, those are the type of conversations you guys yeah. are having now. Yeah, like, because before it would be like, you know what's going on. Okay, you know what's going on. He don't right, like, right, he don't like right, to right, know. So, right. when. He, if he don't fuck with what I do, like, he don't fuck when I do it. Like, he, he well, hate when I do it. No men like that. Yeah, that's First all men. Yeah. That's all men. But now he's starting to get, like, I think, like, cautious. Like, all right, let me not slip up because I can really lose what's so valuable to me. And yeah. from what it seems like, obviously, for what we all see, you hold, I don't know, some, everybody uses y'all as, like, if you ain't holding me down like, like Krishan right. holds right. Blue, Blue down, down, then, like, I don't want oh, it. Like, you have been. just like that, too, but. Vice versa. He just don't know how to show it. Mm. Yeah. Like, he shows it. How old is he? 25. Okay, okay so you guys are both young. really But, like, young. he don't have, a, like, a real good relationship with his mom yeah. or sister. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So that take yeah. like, I'm it taking a lot time. of notes. Yes. Like, yeah, like, yeah. like, damn, we have to rebuild the system back up. Let's put God more love in it. It's going to mm-hmm. be good. Now, how's your relationship with your family, your your parents, your um, mother and father? I'm, like, their mother and father. But they're, Got like, you. but their their wisdom, that phone call on the phone is just... I could I could be a kid on the phone, but in real life, no. Okay, okay. Are you close to them? Yeah, like I can call okay, right now. Okay, okay. Where my phone at? No. <laughs> She's like, I know, but where is mom. it over? <laughs> you got it. So you, so I, you when, okay. go ahead. You still have so you have a close relationship with your parents, but just not a day-to-day thing, but it's just if you call no, them. No, it's like you got to accept for what it is. Yeah, like, yeah, yeah. I don't know. It's like that little thing you have in your head about your parents. Mm-hmm. Yeah. 
I don't know. You probably have good parents. I don't know. I I have I have my mom and dad. They're not married anymore. But me and my dad went through a rough patch. My dad is a hood guy, so it you know we had to grow into our relationship, and that didn't happen until I was twenty five. Mm-hmm. Me and my dad got tight when I was 25. And I'm now we're close. Yeah. I talk to my parents every day. Yeah. But me and my dad had a, it took a while to get it had a, it was a lot of forgiveness that had to take place because my dad was so absent and I I didn't know how much it affected me until I got married and I started raising boys and I started realizing how much that figure was so important and how much I resented yeah. so much of my dad. But when I forgave him, fully forgave him with my whole heart, God told me to forgive him. My relationship with my dad went it was changed it changed forever, and he changed as a person. Yeah, just See, that. My people deal with drugs. I don't even. That's so cool. <laughs> like, yeah, but like I don't it's know. hard when it's. It's like yeah, like I don't know. It's like they not like that, but like if they were dead, it would be no different from now what they are right now. Mm. Like that's what hurts. Mm. Like you care, but yeah, not present. Yeah. So what do you feel like you need from them? Nothing. I mean, honestly, 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 like what would you what what would you what do you feel like you need from them? Like if you could ask them for anything, what would you ask them Time, for? Time, love, is it acknowledgement? To try acknowledgement. Nothing. I just I don't know. I don't I don't even know how to answer that question. Uh Do you feel resentful? Are you angry? Mm-mm. I'm more like. Do you forgive them? Yeah, I'm more like. Damn, you know. Mm. Mm. It this just is hurts. my reality. It just hurts. Yeah, yeah. Like, but that can you know that can shift though. That can shift. It's gonna take time to heal that, but it can shift the, the feeling. You I gotta feeling, get some more money. Why you say that? Why do you think it's money though? So I could just put it right next to me. Mm. You want to take her out of where she is and put? I it did, but then. Oh, it's okay, her baby. medication and shit wasn't out here, so she didn't want to stay here. It's mm. very like, I don't know. Right now, I'm just grinding, so yeah. I don't have time to just. Th- you don't have time to Ash, feel or try to figure things. out what that yeah, is. You're I know. like, I yeah. just need to hurry up and get to it. Yeah, yeah. so I can like make it's it better. Okay, baby. Yeah, but where do you find time to feel? Like, what is your? What's your? Do you have a safe place? Yes, God. Yeah. Like, do you? And you? I find sit in that a car time. and scream to him, mm. or mm-hmm. I go to a hill, run up the hill, like I'm. Running go, to him, and then, mm-hmm. well, yeah, I literally go run to God. Mm. <laughs> it's weird. Mm. No, it's that's not, not weird. weird. That's right. That's yeah, right. That's, that's, what what saying, like, that's what you should do. That's what you should do. That's all I do. <laughs> that's what you should do. Where my phone at, yo? Wow. Y'all but my first word terrible. was hallelujah, so like. You told me that when we was on the phone. Your first word? My first word. When yeah. She was a baby. Wow. Yeah. Where do you feel like you that came from? Huh? Where did that come from? Like you just was that just your environment? You heard that growing like as a no, child. My mom said that like like she she was she was like I'm about to call her. She was tell you it's kind of funny. It's a short story. Mm-hmm. <laughs> okay, call her. Call, okay, call, call her. her. You can yeah, call, her. call her. You want to call her? Yeah, I'm looking for her number. She changed that bitch every week. <clears throat> Where do they live? They still live in Baltimore. Yeah, like she okay. went back to Baltimore. She lived with my uncle. Okay. Mm, that's interesting. Right. I mean, we, your first word, Hollywood. Because I, I yeah. gave her this condo that, that's in Hollywood right now. It's just, Hollywood is not her style. So I'm like, all right, I got to get her house in yeah. Baltimore. Yeah. And I'm not ready for that right now. Yeah. Mm. Yeah. Like, I'm stacking and saving. Yeah. But right now, like, if she asks me, or I have to send her a few dollars, I'll send mm-hmm. her a few dollars. But, like, full time, take care of my little brother's in college right now. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Mm. That's about it. Yeah, I mean that's a lot of pressure though. And you're I, 22. You're a baby. Man. You're, you're yeah, a baby. but like God, like God will put you in position. To absolutely. Do that, to be a- able absolutely. To survive. So it's I agree like, with absolutely. That. I agree it's with that. Like, it's like it's a part of your purpose. Yeah, like your mental have to be like, oh, you feel me? But that's why you have to take care of yourself first, so that you can take care of everybody else. And yeah. I feel like I'm taking care of. Yeah. Just cry like. Yeah. Cry a lot. Yeah. Crying is a good thing though. Huh? It's a, it, crying is a good thing. It's a good release. But even even having that, even having the acknowledgement of, I know that this is what God has chosen me to do, or this is the Very position self-aware. that he's put me in, Very self-aware which is amazing that you have that at 22. That doesn't take away from like the pressure of it. Or you know what pain, I mean? Or the or pain. The stress, yeah. Or the being overwhelmed or like yeah. that might be what God called you to do, but that doesn't mean it doesn't not, hurt. It, or no, it doesn't I, have that, I have that like conversation. Oh, our phone must be dead. He's, he's here, my sister. 
for everybody that's listening, she's trying to get her mom on the phone. For real, so she can tell you her story. <laughs> Our first word was hallelujah. That's crazy. That's a hard word to say. As your first word. It's not a word. word. It's, it's, a, it's the highest, highest praise. praise. Come on. Highest praise. Come That's on. crazy. Angels sing that shit in heaven. Wow. I've been doing that. My is whole a... life been like some lucky ass shit. Like. All right, you guys. Before we go on with this bomb ass episode, bam. Be Simone Beauty is having a sale only for KFS family. So if you're watching this episode, you can use the promo code KFS75. It's 75% off the entire website, you guys. Go get the diamond collection. Go get your makeup bags, your gloss, your liner. We are having a blowout sale until the end of the year. So KFS75 at BeSimoneBeauty.com. She is crazy. <laughs> so if y'all are watching, Megan just ran up behind me. We love y'all KFS family. Back to the show. No, it's so, divine for sure. With your parents and, you know, obviously the world knows Blueface and them got into an altercation. Do you feel like that was like healing some of your childhood trauma? No, I feel he, like, like my siblings, when my siblings, you? they were like, f first of all, I feel like they probably was intoxicated with something. I don't know. Mm. Uh -huh, uh -huh. So that uh -huh. driven like a different spirit too. Um, but I'm saying when that happened, did that feel like a protection for you? From, from blue. From blue. You get what I'm saying? Mm. Because of the trauma that you had with your parents or your dad, like when that situation happened, did it feel like, damn, like he protected me from my dad. He protected me from or my he childhood. Stood up for he stood up for me. Stood up for you. Who? Blue. blue. Oh, Blue punched my dad because my dad hit him for me. Because my dad was like, no. So my sister, she like, just keep talking, keep talking. Like, okay, we get it. We get mm -hmm. the point. But like, if if I had cameras on my sister life and the people that she didn't mm -hmm. fucked yeah, yeah, over yeah. and they're yeah, in a relationship. Yeah, yeah. like, like I said, everybody ugly is not on blast. So it's mm -hmm. like... Nobody wasn't really being real. They was being like one sided mm -hmm. because I'm the baby. And I mm -hmm. get it, but we all grown. Mm -hmm. Let's have a grown conversation, nigga. Like, mm -hmm. you abusive too, bitch. Mm -hmm. Like, we're all are. Mm -hmm. Like, we all have to learn how to not be abusive. Right. Not be like that. Yeah, right. like, yeah, you yeah, feel yeah, me? Yeah. Yeah. So I'm looking at my sister, like, I see you popping it. And then my dad popping it. I'm like, bro, you're the same nigga that wrapped my fucking mom in the woods up mm -hmm. and beat on her. Like, I, I get what you're that. saying. Yeah, I yeah, feel yeah, you, yeah. but. Yeah. Homie. Yeah. Take, everybody, yeah, everybody yeah, to take like, into consideration. Come on. Yeah. Like, so you feel like, people, you feel like people, you feel like you're, you and Blue's relationship or how you guys are because you're so just you, right? It gets judged a lot when you're like, a lot of people are doing no, we, the same. No, we face this naturally by like, that's what we grew up in. Mm -hmm. Like, don't know what Blue grew up in, but I, don't, I know what I grew up in and mm -hmm. how shit going, but I, I feel like you attract whatever you are. So mm -hmm. it's like, mm -hmm. At yeah. the same time, it's it's called like a process of growth. I, I, I don't condone any of like you know, the you know, behavior, whatever. the bullshit. Yeah, yeah. but you're not saying it's right. You're but just you like fight your siblings, like like you fight people that you love. Like mm -hmm. I see that you like. I never was in my life like, I don't know. Like scared for my life. Like mm -hmm. if anything, I'm about to beat your ass back with something. <laughs> like not like that, but it's like right. we just gotta learn how to not use our hands. Right. 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 <laughs> Vice right, versa, right, like right. I'm just as wrong You're as him. Aware. Yeah, you're like so we I'm just like, need to figure out a yes, better way, a way to relearn. These yeah, habits. like now, so, like, but now it's like niggas just walk away. Like, okay, if I'm really that, cause like yesterday I could have like do what I usually would do, cause you got me fucked up. I just stole a car and just spent all. Well, went you to didn't the have to steal it. Yeah, we don't steal, we don't, steal we, it. You we, just we, took we, it. Well, it's mine. It was his. <laughs> he's not gonna. He's not gonna say. Oh, you can. Oh, yo, you could take a breather because you're mad. Like I gotta just. Please. Yeah, Escape. yeah, yeah. Like, yeah. Oh, when you text, oh, I'm a communicator while I'm yeah. gone. Like, yeah. see my location. Well, no. I'm up the street. You could even Uber here if you wanted right. to, nigga, right. or just wait yeah. till I get back. I'm right. really like heated. Yeah. Like, yeah. so I did some shit like that. That's that a better good. alternative. Yeah, it's yes. a better yes. removing yes. yourself from the situation. For sure, yes. because yeah. nigga. Yeah. 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 But who Real do you guys, who do you guys have in your life, or is there someone in your life that is helping you guys find healthier habits for yourselves individually and as a couple? In maneuvering through this because toxicity. it's if you guys don't have the tools you've already said it we don't know we do we be praying and be working that is a tool for are, sure but i'm what saying what are that the daily actions and rituals and oh we're starting practices. to like we're starting to like practices we're starting to like you know do happier things like like real reason why we're fighting is because oh you didn't like what i saw on your phone or you didn't you know mm -hmm. what i'm saying it's like we we we, we show our ugliest and we love each other so mm -hmm. we fight 
All right, you guys, really, really quick. We're about to put you on to something just like we always do here at KFS. I don't know about you, but our diet and health comes first to us. Please don't ignore your dietary needs, guys. Over 97% of women age 19 to 50 do not get enough vitamin D from their diet. 95% don't get their recommended daily omega-3s. I didn't even know that. But look, Ritual took things to the next level, just like we do here at KFS. They invested in the gold standard for research, which is a university-led clinical trial to study the impact of their essential multivitamin for women 18 and up. Yes, the results were an increase of vitamin D levels by 43% Mm -hmm. and omega-3 DHA levels by 41% in just 12 weeks. Listen, guys, there is no shady stuff with Ritual ever. They use traceable and vegan-friendly ingredients that always have clear communication so you know exactly what's in your multivitamin and where it comes from. You guys, we wake up every day and take our multivitamin every morning. And my favorite part about this multivitamin is it does not upset my stomach. I feel great after taking my daily dose every single day single morning. Right now, Ritual is offering our listeners 10% off your first three months. That's for you, you guys, our KFS family. So visit ritual.com slash KFS and turn healthy habits into a ritual. That's 10% off at ritual.com slash KFS. Back to the show. Like, how about we just be cool? Like how high school, like, you know, you're in high school, you're in a loyal ass relationship. Mm-hmm. Just love. be loyal. Just happy. Yeah, let's just be happy. Mm-hmm. Or just leave it. Like let's, let's leave, leave it. Yeah, each let's, other alone. yeah. So yesterday I Happy had a real conversation me. with the nigga. Like, hey, what are we on? Because bro, I'm. I got balls now. What you mean? I will mm. leave everything, even my chains, my watches, at the house. Just yeah. take me to the airport. Yeah. Mm. What do you mean? I'm flying a guy real quick. Take a trip. <laughs> yeah. Right. Yeah. Right. It's not even to another nigga. Not, yeah. I just need to get away. Yeah. yeah. Like, what are we doing? Yeah. So when I finally got balls to say that, it, it, it like, the conversation was more like effective. Like. Mm. Well, truth be told, now like now that we're taking this like further, blah blah blah, blah and you're being more serious, like I have nothing to hide, baby. You yeah. got my cold. You yeah. can, he's starting to like. So you feel like for him, it's just like I a trust thing. Like yeah, it's, it's just a, a trust yeah, thing. It's like, like everybody. Fuck, yeah. Fuck, oh, you know what I'm doing on the side. All right, then I don't want to be doing you no more. Yeah. Then. Mm. Yeah. Yeah. Sorry, I want a husband. And good for mm. you. And good it's for good. you. Good for and good you. for you. Like that's why and I keep getting you. in fights because. Good for you. I know mm-hmm. what I want. Fight, yeah. But, but you know what I'm saying? Yeah. No, I get that. I don't be I don't be fighting, nigga. Yeah, I get that. Good for you. You know what you want and you're setting your boundaries and saying this is what I want and this yeah, is what and we have him, to. He like he he know what he want, but he don't know what he wants, so he's still doing him. I'm like, all right, I'm doing me, but I get in trouble for doing me. What we doing? Mm-hmm. Yeah. For real, mm-hmm. what we doing? But those are decisions you're gonna really have to make, like hard yeah. non negotiables. Yeah. Like if you're saying that this is where I'm at, you need to make a it needs to be a non-negotiable. Even if, you love, them, huh? even if you even love if you them, love them, even if you love them, even if you love them, that's it. If you say this cannot happen any longer and you have to stick to that for your own self and for the relationship, you know what I mean? I'm telling you, next time I'm out. I can't, are you dropping music now still? Huh? I'm a, we got that on camera. The next time you out. So if I, see I was about to say, so, uh, so room, we can hold you, so we I'm can be hold like, you accountable. I've been did us. Like, I'm up FaceTime you. Like, like, maybe like a break. I don't know. He he got potential to be the nigga I want. Mm hmm. What? So could y'all. No, I just, I just think that it, it has to be. It's more for me. Like the cheating part. Well, for me, it's more of a safety thing. Like for me, I look at you and I'm like, she's 22. She's like a little sister. Like I Which look at how I literally we we've been talking I've, about you praying. Like literally, we've me. been talking about you before you even hit so her. the prayer down. No. <laughs> That's crazy. <laughs> we'll pray at the end. Shit. But we love you so, so much. much. Yeah. When you was about to come on Wild and Out, y'all couldn't make it that day. I was like, Megan. I was like, coming up was there. I was there. so excited. I wanted, wanted to hug to you and, and just hug love you. you. And yeah. be like, here's my number. Call me anytime. What do you need? You know, I know. So. so what did you mean when you commented on the shade room? Uh, it was cute. But the I didn't know what it, what it meant. You put a sad emoji. Me? Because I fake cry when I saw the trailer, too. She said I fake cried. No, for real, I cried. I think I think for me. Oh, I put a trailer. Yeah, you did. Yeah, Yeah. I think for me, it it's like we see you and we've seen your the trajectory of where you've been. Became a fan from it's a high ball. That's I know the first Instagram I had. That was years ago. But I just see it's just 
I know, I know what it, I've never been in a physically abusive relationship where we fight each other, right? But I've been in an abusive relationship where we've hurt each other. And I know what it feels like to really love somebody and to be damaged in that love. And to want them to change. And to think, and to say that like, I'm nah, going to love them to change. but if you knock them change down, they break it and you see progress. I actually see shit. Right, but you see that. We like don't my see spirit. that. Right. Oh. So that's what I'm saying. You the see that. We don't see, see that. That's why it breaks our heart because we don't see that. He learning. <laughs> Daddy learning. He gonna get there. I'm like, well, show us some progress. He, he is. No, he, so you know, he is. that's he why is. I think I commented that. Cause and, like, and too, I'm we don't sure. want you guys to hurt each other. Mentally, emotionally, we or physically. We have these conversations, like, what y'all talking about? Like, you know, like, like, you know we've been immature, but we got to show, like, a better side of us. Blah, 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 Right, blah. right, right. Like, when they made this one trailer, <laughs> I didn't like how they, like, made it. Because mm-hmm. it was like... Yo, don't do that. Like, yeah. <laughs> like, yeah. They were making it. Betray this, us like that. Yeah, it was kind of like. Well, you know the, you know that the network's going to do that for views and for. Yeah, and, but if we the uh, executive producers. Of course. Don't do that. Don't, don't do that. Yeah. that. yeah. yeah. For sure. They fixed it. Yeah, yeah. So they fixed it. Like, yeah. Like, we got to. Yeah. Work. So what do you want people wanna, to get from the docuseries? Like, what do you want. And tell us about yeah, it. Yeah. Like, it's a real story. Yeah. It's just like. It's, it's something really relatable, but it's something so entertaining you don't want to miss it. Yeah. Mm. So. And that is longevity. Like, I feel like... You feel like it opens up y'all's story a little more deeper? Yeah, that and two is going to, like... It depends on who you are to make any opportunity, Mm -hmm. like, feed you the way it's supposed to. Mm -hmm. So this is going to feed me like it's supposed to. Mm -hmm. It's going to be a big thing. It don't have nothing to do with the network, but it's, like, who you are. Your story. Who you are, yeah. Your Your truth will finally be out. Like, yeah, type uh, shit. Yeah, yeah. So it's with my family. It's like a mm-hmm. dynamic understanding, but it's like so relatable. Because mm-hmm. yeah. I'm so transparent with my feelings, my words. Yeah. I, wasn't I love giving. that about you. Oh, thanks. I do. I do. I love it. What's your sign? Pisces. <gasps> I'm a Pisces. That's why, I, that's why I probably always see her in this. March 14th. Oh, okay. Wow. And March 9th. is the 13th. Oh, that's yeah. cool. That's crazy. Yeah. Yeah, well, I, and, and that makes a lot of sense because I feel like <laughs> Pisces are very empathetic, deep, like, we, we feel everything, is. and we, yeah, and we just know what it's like to love someone and want, and, like, know what that love can do for that person, you know what I mean? Yeah. Like, it's nah, a very... Well, he really loved me, though, like, before I was making any money, he was kicking it out, and I could see him kicking it out, it's just like... You know how when you're doing things and you just need time to mm-hmm. just... And I don't doubt that. I don't know y'all's relationship, but oh. people, you know, people can only love the way they know how to love. Mm-hmm. Yeah, just because so, someone loves you doesn't mean it's the healthiest yeah, way to like, love. Like, yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. But I'm saying like he, I don't doubt that. At first it was like a business relationship. Then it was like, I don't know if I want you to be my girlfriend. And it's like... yeah. I want you to be my girlfriend, but I still want to do what I want. And now yeah. it's like, all right, what are we on? Because I really, like. But that makes sense if you guys have only been together for a year and a, yeah, over. Yeah, but I've never been in a relationship that's, yeah. it start like, it start like how I want it to start. Like, okay, butterflies, okay, it's just me and you. Mm. That's it grows. It. Mm. Oh, yeah, it's, yeah, yeah. Yeah, like, it's not like, oh, I met you with a family. Oh, I met you with your little fetishes. Like, mm. no. <laughs> Be, I don't, it just, so cute. She's so it's cute. like we, so I can't even explain it, like, I never met no nigga like this before, <laughs> it just was, I was the heartbreaker, I was the one that like would leave, I don't cheat, but like I'll leave you, like, yeah. mm-hmm. I didn't yeah. like something, yeah. oh we gotta break up, Yeah. Mm-hmm. wait, we just, I don't fuck with it, for real, but when I fucked with him, it was like, it was business, then it was like a little fling, then it turned to something else. Yeah. Mm. Yeah. Something else and something else yeah. and something else. Yeah. So now you feel like so you're that's just. That's what we started off of. It wasn't really like. If we started like, oh, you my boyfriend. And then in the first thing, I would have been broke up with him. Right. Right. It was like. Right. We Y'all didn't working. really start off with a commitment. Yeah. 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 But yeah, yeah. we had a commitment and it was work. Like yeah. money. Yeah. Yeah. So it was like. Yeah. Yeah. That regardless, makes sense. I wasn't going nowhere because it was money. Had to yeah. Do with money. Yeah. But then it turned into some other shit. Mm hmm. <laughs> Why are you looking at Because yo. like, I'm looking at my team. Like, can I say Telling this? you, because if he was just started off as my nigga, I would have never fucked with y'all. Dealt with all mm-hmm. of this. Yeah, yeah, yeah like yeah, if it had yeah. nothing to do with money or none, I wouldn't have really fucked with y'all. I would be like, oh, you're not. For me. Yeah. Yeah, you're not for yeah. me. 
and but because it started off that way, it makes you look yeah, at the relationship was, yeah, different. Yeah. 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 So and it's like it has to be a bigger purpose. Stages, yeah. Like, oh, okay. You're not just my little fling on the low. What's going on? Like, I don't know. I think for me, it, it feels. It, you know what not I'm talking that, about? Yeah, though, no, right? I totally understand what you're saying. I, not that I we swear are to God, anybody if you that came we have the to. Other way, like, I don't think I would have been in a. It like, wouldn't be that. Yeah. Yeah, like, okay, he saw him at the club and we got it cracking. Woo woo. And I couldn't, like, establish, like, what I wanted, mm-hmm. like, the first two weeks fucking with you because you want to talk and be my boyfriend. And it's not what it is. I would have been broke out with you. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But it started off, like, straight business. And then, like, you know. You can't like fuck up ties. You gotta mm-hmm. like go all the way through it. It's mm-hmm. money. Yeah. So it was like we was already tied in before that weird shit. Well, that makes me feel like not that it matters how I feel, but it makes me feel better that you guys that you have that mentality of it is progressing. Like we didn't. 100%. I'm not just not going stagnant. through all of this just because I want to fuck this nigga. I'm like there's a bigger purpose to it all, and I've seen the. Oh yeah. You know, now now the bigger purpose is like. Damn, I really love you. Mm-hmm. So it's like, okay, can we learn how to love each other properly? Like, mm-hmm. start setting like real boundaries, cause we're fighting because we're setting fake boundaries. They're like fake. What about how are you gonna tell me not to cheat and you're cheating? Fighting mm-hmm. outside of social media, Femi? huh? Fighting outside of social media though, like posting the 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 bad times. I mean, I'm already. It's like you feel like you're already in it. Yeah, like. At this point, I want to be transparent as fuck with my life mm. and with my fans. Like, I'm really trying to establish longevity. Yeah. So, like, if I'm putting my story out, fuck it, it's part it's of the, the truth. Story. Yeah. There you can be, be, okay there can be a balance, though. Yeah. I'm childish, though. You feel me? Yeah. yeah. And you're young. <laughs> oh, <God. laughs> you're like, I am a child. I'm like, the character. That character should be playing. Right? I love that you're very <laughs> self aware. I'm, 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 I'm like, I get it, but, but I'm in real still a life. Child. I like, I'm it. UV, but in real life. Like, it's like I'm being a but real. like, better. Like, more childisher. Right. So, do you feel. Do you You're f- so pretty, y'all. We have no makeup on. Stop. You mm. <laughs> <laughs> Daddy, thank you. Don't put that tooth back in your mouth. I like you with the gab. You don't, For real? Stop wearing a little fake tooth. It, so you right. never want her to like, have a tooth? I like that. It's, I mean, what, just, but I, I'm it like, fits me as an image. I get it. I mean, but I'm saying, do you mind it? You don't care. No, because once it fell out, boy. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, what you going to do now with it? I don't know. I don't really. Uh, <laughs> How did it fall out? Oh God, this story. <laughs> so he, we was doing this little TV show, exactly. So I was working for him. <laughs> so, I, <laughs> so it started. Look, for real, I, I auditioned for his TV show. Um, he saw my star qualities and made me his artist. That's how. But before that, his baby mama, um, some other, oh his sister and a group of bitches pull up, and then like, I'm thrown off a little bit. Like you got into a fight. No, they was trying to like bank me, but I like try to give myself time. So I'm like, I get up, I'm about to, I'm about to steal the bitch. But I'm like, hold on, I fuck with you, I fuck with you, because I'm counting the heads is <laughs> coming in. I'm like, oh shit. She's like, we're friends, we're I, friends. No, because if Wait, I started. Wait, you gotta stay on the mic or they can't hear you. If I started, you know, <laughs> damn, I didn't give myself no time. She said, I fuck with you, I fuck with you. You know, I was, I, I was like, nah, because I remember please. saying that, like I was stalling. You said that? She said, I, I don't know who, stalling. I didn't say please. She, was she saying, said, no, I didn't she say was please. Saying, let I her fuck say, with you. Let her no, say. she like, she came in, she was like, something, 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 my man's, you, you be on my man's. I, I, I was still confused with who she was. I'm like, what is this? And it was his baby mom. And the cameras went up and like, yeah, it was his BM. Like, I was kind of confused, like, what's going on? So, I'm like, I, I fuck with you. Because <laughs> I started saying like. That's me all day. Nah. And you know like, I can't fight. I fuck with you. No, nah, because look, I'm ready to hit him. You got, I wait, him, you like, have to stay on the mic okay. or they can't hear you. As soon as I hit the, damn. As soon as. <laughs> As soon as I hit the blunt and I like, I peep like how many bitches is right behind her. I'm like, oh, sh- you're not about to just so then fight. What you about to like start. So how did your tooth fall out? Oh, I, I was like, she was like, it wasn't even that. It wasn't. <laughs> so look, Rashawn. imagine, imagine, look, imagine they coming in right. <laughs> you have to keep the mic or the viewers. Right, then I'm gonna walk, walk with it then. Imagine, <laughs> damn, Jesus. Hey, where is the other? You have at? to sit right there. Just pitch, paint the picture, Just Krishan. Move your hand. I can't. You can't. Paint the picture. You can do it. <laughs> you can do it. 
Pain. Sorry, the couch is an okay. L couch. Okay, there you okay? go. Damn. So <laughs> we doing this. I'm backing up, like counting the heads, and then his sister jump on the couch. I'm like, what the fuck is you doing up there? <laughs> so then I get around right here. It's like a like, big it's horse. Bad. It's like a TV right there, but it's a horse, like a statue. So I get behind a, a horse and I hit my mouth. On the horse? Yeah, because I try to run with my socks. I slip. <laughs> And all I hear is crunch, like damn. Oh. But I almost knocked myself out. Jesus. I swear to God. So I like, Ugh. like it was like a commercial, like a little cartoon. You know how the cartoons be? You don't go nowhere, but you run in, and then you and you just off. slid right into the statue mm-hmm. and busted your. Yeah, but I, I, I like reacted so quick. I know. Not She's, be, you got a mic. We gonna have a whole episode. I know. We and need, she nobody need, gonna be able to hear you. She needs a. Uh, she needs a. I'm not enough. You know. <laughs> So, I know she's so cute. <laughs> when she smiles, it's just the cutest thing. In the oh world. my god, I hate it. it. <laughs> Why? Oh my god, you hey. look so. You, when you smile, it is literally like the prettiest thing. It's so cute. It's like a kid. Yeah, you, but it's I like. Hate it. <laughs> <laughs> hey. Damn, let's get to the story. Oh, Yo, took my mouth. On the horse. It didn't. It oh. just was hanging. Mm-hmm. The dentist had to pull it out. No. Jesus. But I thought I knocked the whole front of the shit out because all of it was tender, but only one cracked. Well, I think this one cracked. It just, I ain't taking that out. Yeah, it's don't. About to Please. Yeah, don't take that out. But the dentist was trying to because it said cracked up here. Too. Do you want some more? Yeah. Ginger. <laughs> <laughs> We feel please. <laughs> Thank it's you. hot in here. Take your jacket off. Is it hot? She got it's a, a jacket. On. It's a shirt. Oh, it's a I'm big sorry. ass shirt. It's oh. my nigga shirt. Okay. okay. Hey Blue. <laughs> hey Blue. Hey Daddy. Not Daddy. Where are you going? Where are you going? I need a break. Y'all, y'all see? She needs a break. She okay. needs a break. Take a, take a okay. Take a break. <laughs> she needs a break. Take a five. Uh, I'm just hot. It's you hot? hot. They were hot. I was. You I was cold. Okay, Don't so ha- do we okay. need to get a... Do you need some water? A well, test? A test. I know. I'm not pregnant. I probably got liquor poisoning, hopefully. What? <laughs> no, not hopefully. Uh, I don't want you to have that either. That. Then what is it? I'm hot, and I'm like... Do you feel like you're about to throw up? No. Yeah. Yeah? Okay, you maybe you want you. some ice? Help her, yeah. seriously. Jay, can you hurry up? You're just talking. <laughs> 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 she like, bitch, hurry up. Please. It's looking at me crazy. Thank you, Ash. hot. You not hot? No. Yeah. Oh, oh, dang. I don't have any. Something Is sour. She needs something you can sour. Go oh, go ahead. Is it hot here? Y'all, you not hot? <laughs> We're comfortable. Everybody's cold. I'm cold. You hot? Oh, she hot. Cool. She just okay. said it to make She's you feel like you wasn't crazy. Just keep drinking and drink, girl. <laughs> <Is> this <laughs> leather that make you hot? Yeah. Oh, all right. Yeah, yes. leather. You're so cute. You're cute, too. Both of y'all. Krishan. Thank you for coming. Wait, okay. What is your... Oh, I want to talk about her career goals, though. But okay, yeah. Now I was going to do the ice Oh, let's wait. We, we, about, we about to switch gears. Well, yeah, gears. let's turn up. Let's yeah. do, okay. switch it up a little bit, and let's do... We almost done. Okay, I know y'all you're ready drink? to get up. No, I don't want to leave. We do, but we, we're, we're not drinking out to, on this episode. Not with me looking like that. <laughs> How you gonna fly out and not be in the episode? That's so crazy. We're shooting her episode next. She can come in. Oh, we're shooting an episode with her. Okay, oh, we're talking about pretty V, y'all. So she we're gonna there. play. So you gonna look like that? And you're, the, you're a real nigga for real. <laughs> I should have came with no lashes. You don't have to. You're pretty, but you don't need any. Yeah, but that. I put up with no makeup. And I put so much makeup on. <laughs> she was in the car, lying in her lips. I'm like, come on. Right, and I'm like, she's like, I ain't put no makeup. I'm like, I wish I was that pretty. The fuck, you are. You are girl. It was a joke. Oh, okay, okay. okay. Yeah. Like, I know. I'm I know pretty. I'm that cute, <laughs> but are. not that cute. <laughs> that bitch too. I, I know, know I'm that cute, but not that cute. <laughs> <laughs> so okay, we're gonna play this or that. All right, okay, good rapid fire. Successful love or successful career. What's up, you guys? Hey, you guys. I know, I know. Y'all probably upset if you're not on Patreon. Because it ended like that. But part two of this conversation, we got a whole 45 minutes left. It's going to be on our Patreon. It's going to be on our Patreon. Make sure you guys go subscribe to our Patreon where all of our bonus and extended content is on. And you don't want to miss this. Part two with Krishan Rock. It was very, so very, good. very interesting. Make sure you guys go check it out. That's our baby. We love her. And thank you guys for watching part one.
go check out part two on Patreon. Successful love or successful career? Successful Which, love. Okay. What the fuck is the career for? You don't right. got no love. Oh, y'all people crazy. <laughs> is he interested in a relationship with God? Well, he love God. He just, it, it's like I can pull that out of him because it's really him. Mm. It's already in there. Yeah, it it's is. In there. It's in there. It's, it's in just there. that bitch needs to just be lit up. Mm. Not a right motherfucker. God will send for you. Like, I feel like he sent me to him. To mm. him. Wow.